My name is Nancy Houghton. I am a current, current foundation board member for Community Hospice, as well as the camp director for Camp Aaron of the Central Valley. I've been with Community Hospice, I think this is about the 12th year. I started out on the Community Hospice um, Inc. board and have since moved to the foundation board and all through that time have been the director for Camp Aaron. I continue to support this organization because I just can't see anything else in the world that does what this organization does. Uh, not only in our communities in San Joaquin and Stanislaw County, but nationwide as, as the hospice um, uh, spirit, you know, takes care of so many people and does so much outreach that is of benefit to wherever they are. Community Hospice is important to me because it allows me to give back to the communities that I live in, number one. Uh, number two, it helped me with my mom when she passed at 101 and it was so nice, not in this area, but it's the same spirit and it, what was so nice about it was that even though I'm a, a, a member of Community Hospice, that somebody else came in and played that role for me so I could be a daughter. Seeing Community Hospice grow and change just uh, in so many ways, I think it just continues to broaden the service area. I'm in San Joaquin County, and now we have an office in Stockton in San Joaquin County. It's growing. We have Friends of Hospice there. We have supporters. So now I feel that uh, that county, which is under our service, is going to continue to grow and expand and serve the people just like they do in Stanislaw County. And uh, I, I've seen that growth and change. I've seen the growth by the addition of Camp Aaron to our services, which will continue. And eventually I'm sure it will go maybe to two camps because there are so many children that need um, that service. Um, and I've just seen it just get better in terms of defining what we do. Um, I've seen the addition of palliative care, which I think is an incredible important addition to our services. And I, what I see the most is the continual reassessment and evaluation of where we are and what we're doing and what can we do better and how can we serve our community better. I see that in every aspect of um, community hospice. 40 is young in my, <laughs> in my life, but 40 years for hospice is an incredible time, an incredible journey, and to have been part of that for this many years has been a, truly been an honor. And, um, 40 is just an amazing thing. It's just sort of, uh, I mean, you look back at the history and, and how it started and just by people responding to a need. And bottom line, that's still what we're doing. It's just a larger number of people responding to the same need, the same service, and allowing us to give back to our communities that give so much to us to be able to continue with their support.